Today, in this short tutorial, I would like you to show you how to use the electronic books of the library. So from the university's homepage, you click on library. Then you hover over resources and there you will see electronic resources. You click on electronic resources. In the middle, you will have the A to Z database list. You can click on that. Then we go to E because we're going to eBook Central. This is where we have our electronic books. You will be requested to authenticate yourself. This is the normal login details that you use, your campus login details. If you have any problems with your passwords, please phone the help desk at 051-401-2000. But normally your campus login details will be sufficient to authenticate yourself. Right, so you have your search box over there. So you can search according to topics. Um, I'm just going to search online learning and you click on search. And there you will see there's quite a number of electronic books available. You can scroll down and you will see the list. So if you want to look at one of the books, you just simply click on the title. And here you will have your various options. So you can read it online. So you can just click on it and you can read through it. Or you can download the book. Or you can download the PDF chapters. If you download a PDF chapter, it will remain on your computer. If you download the book, you will be requested to issue it out for 2 or 3 or 21 days. You will get the option. But if you download the chapters, if you scroll down, you will see the chapters over there. And if you download the PDF and you download this chapter, it will remain on your computer. All right. It's just when you download the complete book that you will need to borrow it out. So you can see their pages remain to copies you can copy 45 pages and download is up to 89 pages um, so you also have um, citation option so this will help you with your citation we normally use the Harvard style at the university this is just the guidance on how to do the referencing there might be some small differences so you can also discuss that with your lecturer but this is a basic indication on how you will cite the book that you've used here I hope this tutorial will help you accessing the electronic books that the university library has available